I think yeah, at school or something. Today, I look up at the clock on my wall and it's the afternoon. It's sushi. Where's my alarm clock? I'm <laughs> Yare, yare da ze. Ciao everybody, I'm your big bro Kanetsu. Yeah! And welcome back to Worst Dating Sim. Summer is finally in full swing, so I got to just today eat. They're doing work outside somewhere, so there's even noises. What a great day. <laughs> anyway, let's play the game. And it's finally time to ask more questions to Etsushi. I cannot wait, even if... They are quite lame questions. Let's just ask this question. So, Geshin, who the hell is this? He's the leader of another gang, Spurious. Their gang is known for beating up weaklings 24 7 for the hell out of it. That sounds really bad. They're Kosher's rival gang, rightfully so. So, you're a paladin of justice! Oh, isn't it cute? <laughs> Kosher is my gang! The right gang. Oh, what did I do? What is this? Oh, there's an history? Go figure. <laughs> Every time I play this game, I discover something new. <laughs> we only mess with punks who mess with us first, and like Geshin's corrupt gang. However, being a member isn't easy, you need more serious trust with me first. Let's ask about the piercing before the sister, because the sister, I'm guessing. It's not comfortable to talk about that stuff yet. Your piercing. These babies. I got all this piercing when I was 15. Whoa, that's a long time ago. <laughs> I didn't tell my parents so I got in trouble. They let me keep them anyway. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Why are you asking this question? Are your nipples pierced? <laughs> <laughs> shit, why did I ask that so suddenly? Shit, shit, shit. Uh, come on, what is he going to do? <laughs> He's blushing. <laughs> yeah, why? <laughs> oh, man. That's adorable. J just wondering. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> I forgot to make character name, whatever. <laughs> he's kinda... He kinda know what he's doing either. Don't you think? Don't you think that he knows what he's doing, this guy? He's asking the right thing. <laughs> okay, time to talk about the sister. There you go, the music go away. Silence is not a good sign. Oh no! Look, I don't know where I heard about my sister, but I don't want to talk about it. And that I already knew. Okay, I kinda have PTSD because I don't want to get the wrong answer in the next thing that comes, pop ups, whatever. Okay, don't talking. I'm done talking too. We are both done talking. Yet another sweet talking session. He's starting to scream again. Oh, this really feels like a sleepover now. Mm. It's sushi, you can take off your jacket if you're going to sleep over. I'm insisting so I can get a better look at your body. <laughs> don't mind me. Well, I don't mind me either. <laughs> ah! <laughs> if you say so. <laughs> one arm. Done. Wait, what? Just one arm? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> so lame. Is he going to say something? It's sushi. Your jacket is still on. Bro, I have to maintain my hand in jacket pocket and also hand in pants pocket pose. I, I didn't notice you keep your other hand in your pocket. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Is that necessary? Then you can just put it back on. I mean, we got a glimpse of biceps. We're okay with that. Anyway, I should get to sleep now, since I have school tomorrow. Why don't you just ditch in? Oh my god, he wants to make me... He wants to make me ditch school? That's already big influence. I know you're a fag and everything, but... I gotta go to school, come on, give me a break. Wow, well, no, my parents will find out and murder me! You're right, I'm a bad influence, sorry, oh! 
You're too kind. He knows. He knows. But if you want, you can stay here until I come home tomorrow. Then we can go out to eat like you said, remember? Oh, wait. Do you trust him at home alone? You are really nice to let me stay at your place like this, bro. Of course, I want you to be comfortable here. Just pretend it's like your own home. Seriously, bro, you're something special. Well, good night, Sushi. Good night, bro. Oh, he's so happy. Look how happy he is. I like when he's happy. <laughs> and we all go to sleep. I wonder if I'm going to dream something. Nope, no dreams. Okay. I woke up early. I hope so, at least. What kind of dumb question is this? Just watch the goddamn clock. Bro, yeah, up. Oh my god, he's already up. Oh, my ears. Oh, I yeah, made your breakfast. What? He made breakfast? I'm gonna marry him. You know how to cook? Oh, hell yeah. Say hello to the ultimate brofast. Oh my god, I'm scared. <laughs> brofast, I'm scared. What the hell is he going to make me eat? Oh, wait. Oh my god. Look at that. It doesn't look out bad. Seriously, I hope you like it, bro. Thank you for the food. Ah, that was surprisingly delicious. Oh my god, it's so sweet. He's the last person who will expect to cook so perfectly. <laughs> That's exactly true. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Oh, he's all blushing again. Mm -mm. Okay, now he's serious. By the way, is it normal to make breakfast in the afternoon? I made breakfast and she had just woke up, so I thought it would only be natural. Oh my god, afternoon? <laughs> what time is it? Huh? <laughs> what I'm saying is, it's past breakfast time, it's the afternoon. I think yeah, at school or something today. I look up at the clock on my wall and it's the afternoon. It's sushi. Where's my alarm clock? <laughs> I smashed it. Why? <laughs> you what? Why did you do that? <laughs> okay, so it started ringing hella loud because you know, that's what alarm clocks do. And he started pissing me off and he started pissing me off. So I smashed it. <laughs> I missed school completely. What am I supposed to do now? Tell them you were sick. Oh my god, he got the answers even! Mm. <laughs> I, I can't believe I stayed up so late with the sushi, I really can't keep track of time. Man, well, I missed most of my school day. I might as well just hang out with the sushi. No reason to be so down. Oh my god, he got... <laughs> well, <laughs> I can't blame him. <laughs> Taking just one day off, that's fine I guess. Is my rebel stage starting? Just wait for the slot phase. You know what? Let's go out to it right now. Turns out I am ditching school. Seriously, bro? You're growing up? Even for you're already an adult? That's growing up for you? Also, you literally just ate. Is your stomach that checked? Don't worry about me. I'll just be buying you food. What am I, sugar daddy now? <laughs> oh... Let me put on some shorts and we'll get going. Oh, hell yeah! More yakitori, please! Yeah, take what you want. I could send the store clerk is intimidated. Poor guy. <laughs> mm, it kind of feels like it's Suji and I are dating now. Just going on little dates like this is giving me that vibe. Wait, what am I saying? We met just a few days ago. This is going by too fast. Says the guy that in his dream said, I love you already to the guy, so... First... Oi bro, you are doing okay? You look upset. Damn it. I don't want to lie about the emotion I'm feeling. That's not what a bro will do. Oh my god, are we going to confess? Are we going to confess? Are we going to confess? I shall just... Give him the silent treatment. Ah, oh, this is so lame. Should I... Oh, okay... I guess we're going to do it with the silent treatment. Okay, silent treatment. Ah. You don't have to say anything if you don't want to. Phew! Okay. What do you think about. 
<laughs> Why do you think about me? <laughs> Why do you want to know that? Oh my, I love you. That's completely incorrect. Let's keep on quiet. Stay quiet. Stay quiet. Okay. <laughs> Can we go to the park now? Oh my god, I... <laughs> Come on, I couldn't say that. That was too much, too much. Sure. Hell yeah! Let's go to the park. We only go to the store and the park. We are so lame as a couple, goddammit. Anyways, I was saying this punk fruit food in my face. How could I not clobber him? Yeah, no! Ah, at least you fought him a lesson. And then this guy, and then this other guy. Okay, no more music. A cat. Wow. And he disappears. It's Uji. It's Uji. He hid behind me again. There was a stray cat. Its white fur is a bit dirty and it looks quite skinny. I wonder how long it's been out here. Bro, what the hell are you doing? Are you an absolute madman? You don't know what that thing is capable of. It's just a cat, I don't think we're capable of much. I reach my hand out to pet it and it nuzzles me. I think it likes me. Oh, it has a collar. Its name is Manila. I flip the collar tag over and notice an address. Oh, don't tell me we're going to bring the cat home. <sighs> that sounds so lame. It's sushi. It looks like this stray cat ran away from its home. We have to find the house with its address and return her. What? No, 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 no way! I pick up the cat and show it sushi. See? She's harmless. She's even purring. Taking a closer look, she appears to be cl the clower too. Oh no! Taking a closer... Oh no! Poor thing! Hey! Please, I'm banging ya! She ripped my elbows out! Itsuji stop being a baby and at least pet her. Itsuji slowly starts reaching his hand out and pats a red reluctantly. <laughs> She's purring even louder. <laughs> oh, I think she likes you more than me. <laughs> really? Oh, yeah, really, baby, really. Yeah, she's even looking at you peacefully. Maybe it's best if you hold her, huh? What? Oh wait, it's already there. See, she likes you. Oh my god, you look so adorable with the cat right next to you. Wait, no, this is... Right, when I put Vanilla down on Sushi's shoulder, she started nuzzling his head. I don't know if I should be jealous. K Kitty, please, don't claw my ear off. Hearing him talk about how talk he is just a moment ago and now seeing him like this? It's entertaining, really. Oh my god. You're making fun of me. <laughs> no, I'm <j> no, I'm not a sadist. <laughs> I like how he's almost answering the question or the thing that I say. <laughs> Isn't it weird? <laughs> she's not going to scratch you. She's the clawed anyway. The clawed? Yeah, like the owner had her claws removed surgically. I guess to prevent the cat from scratching you. What? Do you surgically remove a man's knuckles? No, everyone needs to defend themselves one way or another. Okay, we'll find our owner. But I'm beating them up when we do. <laughs> oh, I kinda like him like this, you know? Please don't, no, please do. <laughs> we had yet to find our owner. My sense of direction is so horrid. I thought that Sushi would have a better grasp on this area since he practically lives outside. But I guess wrong. Bro, are we any closer to finding this cat's owner? Um, maybe. Oh, actually, we should buy her some food and water. She probably needs it. Oh, true that. I know you feel kitty. Here's some fish, kitty. Ah, she's eating out of my hand. She looks really happy now. I hope she hasn't been out there for too long. Hmm. I take a few steps towards Vanilla and take another look at the address on her tag. Just double checking. This is near my house, I think. Really? <laughs> it's usually I think I know where the owner might be. Ah, oh, well, let's get going. I still gotta beat up that square. 
Hmm, is this the place? We came to the house, knocking on it for a while, only to realize nobody was answering. I told Tsuji to continue knocking if someone came to the door while I asked some locals in the air about this house for some more information. Oh, the cat is ours. The cat is ours. We're going to bring him home. I'm sure of it. After gathering some info, I ran back to Tsuji. This is the right address, but it appears the owner. Oi, why ain't this joker answering the door? Isn't this around the time everyone gets home from work? You think they would answer the door in a heartbeat since they know their cat's missing? Atsuji, I think the owner moved out. Ah! The people ask said, The owner moved out a couple weeks ago and didn't bother finding her cat anymore since her cat ran away so much. So she left her behind. What a piece of shit of a human being. Ah. Good. What? I'm glad the runner's gone. That dog will be smashed in the ground. You buy a pet and change it against his will to have it suit your peaceful lifestyle thinking it's gonna hurt you when you're the one hurting it. You're just losing their trust. I'm keeping her. Oh, and I'm keeping you. <laughs> what? But it's... A Bro! You gotta face your fear somehow. This fear... Has turned into a friend. No, a bro. Isn't he adorable? Come on. Can I adopt him? <laughs> we'll be homeless, bro. Damn it! <coughs> hey, hey, bro squad. Seeing a Tsuji grow like this is really something special. Hey, oi, bro. I don't think I would be bros with bro Bronilla if you weren't here, so thank you. No need to thank me. You overcome your fear yourself, it's sushi. I guess I did. Oh yeah, boy, look how happy he is. Yeah, I did it. He did it. He's so happy. What shall we do now? <laughs> Make out. Can I pet vanilla and I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> of course we cannot make out is you can't do that I want to pet the cat can I pet the cat will you let me pet the cat can I pet the cat what no she's very comfortable with me petting her oh my god you got not over this why what is wrong with you what is wrong with what is wrong with him oh even the cat now does meow I'm not sure. I'm not sure what to say yet, so I'm not sure. But I, I mean, I'm not really sure what to do. So I'm not sure. Uh, we are not sure. I'm not sure. True. What can you do after today? Maybe you shall head home. And uh, buy you a new clock on your way there. All right. Go figure. You're right. I'll see you after school tomorrow then. See ya, bro! Oh, wait, no, we're going to encounter the fags again. No, no, we got home. We got home safely. Oh my god! Oh my god, we totally forgot about Megu. Oh my god. Oh, Megu, I, uh. It's nice to see you back. Thanks. I guess she doesn't mind talking with me still after what happened. Thank goodness. It's not easy being sick. Some people think it's a free ticket starting home, but it's hell. <laughs> Shuchinko, I know you weren't sick yesterday. Game over! You were with the tall man that showed up the other day. Hmm. It's not your dad, I'm assuming. I lied. I'm sorry. Mm. That look on her face is really scary. <laughs> I don't mind. Oh, really? Oh, really? Seriously? Thank you. Oh, wait. What happened? We all have our kinks. Oh, wait. What? We all have our kinks. I have no place to... What? Mego! What the hell are you thinking? I'll be heading home now. <laughs> Oh, okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Why? Why? You want to know more, you pervert? 
damn it, I knew I was going to be made fun of. Oh, it's already here, oi! It's Suji, can you please wait until I'm actually out of the school? Are you embarrassed with people seeing us together or something? <laughs> We're not exactly a likely pair to be seen in public together. Okay. We're going to meet some gang members? Boss! Ah! What are you doing here? Oi! Who is this kid with you? Oi, he's a bro, don't touch him! Seriously? Well, thank goodness. Oh, he's the kosher member. Oh, look at him. We got another guy. The kosher gang ain't got many members compared to Spurious, so we got a lot of beef for being the underdogs. Name, the name's Kumochi, but you can call me Mochi. I devote my heart and soul to my boss. Nice to meet you, little bro. Oh, is he, is he my rival or something? <laughs> oh, wait, oh, it's a little embarrassing too. I'm not gonna make fun of my boss for hanging out with his boyfriend. You know what? Am I already a boyfriend and does he know? Do you know about him? Wait, wait, boyfriend already? What is going on here? Look, <laughs> he got embarrassed right away. We are not dating, you damn fool. <laughs> really? But I saw you smiling around him, boss. You don't even smile around me and I'm one of your closest bros. We just got them to know each other real well over these past few days. Nothing's going on! Oh, I don't don't like this. Whatever you say, boss. Also, I just noticed that cut. Oh, no! Okay. Yes! What is this? Arias. Arias. <laughs> yeah, her name's Vanilla. She's a bro, too. If you say so, boss. Haha, <laughs> you two seem to get along well. Boss is a very loyal guy. He's always telling story about how he gets into fights because some punks may fathom his looks or something. You and Tsuji must fight a lot of those spurious goons, huh? Like some superhero duo. I don't fight at all. Oh, he's a peaceful guy. Hmm, not at all. I'm not much of a violent guy, little bro. Why join a gang then? I stopped fighting once I left the Spurious gang and after that I was really reluctant to fight anybody. I didn't take long for Geshin to kick my ass out. <laughs> you were in the Spurious gang? He's a traitor? <sighs> yeah, kinda said right. They advertise their gang like some writer's organization but what lies underneath that cloak is a bunch of egoistical Lame asses obeying gashings like a god. Ooh, that that sounds like a cult. Before I could even know what kind of gang Spurious was, I was kicked out for refusing to fight anyone, of course. I was a school dropout. My family kicked me out knowing I'd never succeed. I had nowhere to turn to. Oh, man. I just sat on the sidewall, thinking whether or not I should just lay down on the road and wait until a car comes by. Oh, poor guy, poor guy. Then Tsuji showed up. We were practically in the same boat, both dropouts, both homeless. He saw some special potential in me that I didn't even see myself. He asked me to be the first member in his gang. Oh, that's so sweet. The first one. Once I joined, it was an instantly unbreakable bond. I respect him for as long as I live. I'm at a loss for words. Yeah, we cannot say anything anymore. Such a strong bond, almost like a family. Mochi was on the verge of taking his own life and Etsuji saved him. Etsuji really is an amazing guy. Shit, sorry, I've just been rambling. How embarrassing. It was nice meeting ya, but I gotta go get some miso soup. Don't feel war. Doing field work for my grandma takes a lot out of ma <laughs> out of a guy. <laughs> I said this already five times and I screwed up, so I'm not going to say that any again. It doesn't matter. <laughs> then I'll see you soon, Mochi. And Mochi gone away. What are we going to do now? Sorry about that. 
much kinda bats into conversation from time to time. Still a good brother. I'm glad you two are bros now. He's surprisingly calm and collected despite being in such a violent gang at one point. Much is killer whale sleeper says a lot about his personality already, I suppose. Oh, that's why you wanted me to say killer whale, because they're much is lippers. Hell yeah, he's one of my best bro, I'll be with him until the end of time, damn it. Anyway, let's get this talking session started, bro. Another talking session? Ooh. Okay. I guess this is the cue to end the episode. Game over! We're going to ask a Suji question next time. Damn it! <laughs> I'm so sweaty got the <laughs> playing this game in this it. I don't think you <laughs> Anyway, I hope you did enjoy this episode. Leave a like if you need some, subscribe if you want to see the next episode, and thank you so much for watching. And remember that I am proud of you and I believe in you, and I'll see you in the next video. Ciao!